I am here at the Vidalia Onion Museum. Come and see how the Vidalia Sweet Onion came to be. I am here now at the Vidalia Onion Museum, and I am here with Ingrid and Richard. And Ingrid, tell us a little bit about the museum. Um, the museum actually was redone, and we just opened again in 2011 this year um, to kind of kick off our Onion Festival. And it just features our world-famous product from Vidalia, the, the Sweet Onion. And is there any little bit of history that we may want to know about the museum? Sure. Um, yeah, the, the onion was kind of founded by accident in the 1930s by Mose Coleman when he planted onions and realized that they were sweet due to the soil in the Vidalia area um, instead of hot onions. So um, it's kind of stemmed from that. And right now you can grow Vidalia onions in 13 counties and parts of seven others. So it's a, it's a protected, it's federally protected onion. And we're just very proud to have the museum here to feature it. And tell us a little bit about the um, tourism board that you're with, too, or the tourism. Um, I'm with the Vidalia Area Convention and Visitors Bureau, and um, we're funded with the hotel motel tax money um, from tourists that come in and stay in the area. And we just promote Vidalia and try to get people to come see our little piece of sweet heaven. <laughs> that is awesome. Now, Richard, you've got to tell us a little bit about the events that are going coming up, right? Right. I have the best job in all of Vidalia because I get to go around and plan, help plan these big events. You know, our biggest one coming up here pretty soon is the Vidalia Onion Festival. It'll be the 35th annual. This year is going to be totally different. There is no air show, but we have 11 new events coming. It's probably going to be the biggest onion festival there ever was. I mean, we have some shocking, shockingly different things coming. It's going to be real exciting. But between now and April, can I even say this on TV? We've got a cornhole tournament coming, a professional cornhole tournament. It's the American Cornhole Organization's tournament. It's uh, $20,000 in prize money. It's going to be right here in Vidalia, Georgia. Teams coming in from all over the country. There's already uh, crews signed up from New Jersey and um, Iowa or Idaho. I don't know. It's, it's, it's out there somewhere. It's, it's not, they're not from around here, but there's a bunch of them coming. Uh, but Ingrid and I work on putting these events together for the community year-round. I mean, we, we work on all different types of things to, to try to get people to come to Vidalia. And, and you know, truly, we, neither one of us feel like we work because we just have a great time telling people to come on to Vidalia and have a sweet time visiting. Well, that sounds like fun. Now, can anyone come in and visit the museum and, and visit you all and absolutely. participate? Absolutely, absolutely. The museum's open, uh, I always say generally, Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, because, you know, we, if we're not here, it will be closed. But uh, it's free. Uh, you come on in. It's a self-guided tour. If you have questions, you stop and ask us. If we don't know the right answer, we'll make something up. You won't know the difference, you know, and, and you just come and have a great time. And it's so neat that you have so many people participating in these different events that you have. I mean, that, that is really interesting. It, it, it is. Vidalia and this area is a wonderful area. You know, I'm not from around here, but one of the best things I think about of our area is we've got a lot of folks here that aren't from here. So we have a lot of different things going on and a lot of different thought to how to make things better and get them. And that's what we just have a great time putting it all together with them. Well, it sounds like y'all do have a great time around here, and it would be so neat to come in and visit and just a family time to see the museums and, every, and everything. Well, I appreciate y'all. Let us come and visit. And have a sweet time with us. Yeah, there you go. And, and, show your, and you can show me more around by day. Does that sound good? We, oh, yeah. We have fun night <laughs> We're going to show you cornholing. There you go. That's what I need, education on cornholing. <laughs> Thanks.